I am Lauren Conrad, and these are my tips for getting girl next door sexy. I think the first date outfits are very tricky, and they also depend on where you're going. That's really important to find out ahead of time because you know you want to be dressed appropriately. Whether you're doing an activity or going to a nice restaurant, I usually go with something. Um, kind of balanced out, so like maybe um, you know a leather legging and a really feminine blouse. So you want something really sweet and pretty, but you want to bring in like a little bit of a cool factor. Being sexy is you know maybe picking one thing to show off, whether it's your shoulders or if you want to wear a shorter skirt and balance it off with a sleeve, or a lower cut top and then wear a, you know a longer hemline. I think that if you can walk in them, they're fine. I think the higher the better. I love a high heel. I mean, as long as you're not going into like lucite, then you're fine. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, if you can walk in them, they're good. I always say that if you've got it, flaunt it and be proud of your body. But there is definitely, you can definitely go too far with cleavage. You don't want it to be in your face. You don't want it to be the first thing people notice. Um, but I think that a little bit of cleavage is fine. The go-to hairstyle for a glamorous girl next door is probably just really natural. Maybe, you know, a nice blowout with some waves. You think it's nice to have touchable hair. You don't want it overstyled. Think of like a Victoria's Secret curl, that really like, um, you know, beachy blowout wave. The side pony that I normally wear, whether it's on a carpet to an event, isn't actually a side pony. It's actually centered on the back of my head, but I normally pull it over to the front of one side just because if I don't, I look like a little boy with no hair. So uh, whenever I wear my hair back like that, I always pull it forward. So it does have kind of a, a side pony effect, but it's just actually a low pony. 